Welcome back, everybody. As you can see here, I did a shakedown through the night. Oh, you can see there, there was a shit ton of contraband found there. Not impressed. But, that being said, at least it seems that the uh, contraband feature is working pretty good. And you'll also notice, maybe today, you'll notice that uh, we have a nice sum of $10,000 to spend. Yes, sir. Our prison cells are filling up again. We're going to finish off this prison block, and then we're going to hold on to our cash and make another addition to the prison, which will hopefully be, um, excuse me, the more or less finishing touch. You know, I'm going to try something. I'm going to give these prison cells windows and just see if that improves the quality of anything. That was an expensive little gift. We'll see. Because normally I don't give them prison windows, because that's just an expense they don't deserve to have. Come on, you'll figure it out. Come on, stop breakdancing. Stop breakdancing. Come on now. Stop your fucking breakdancing. There you go. Does each one of these cells have a light? No. No. Yes, yes. No. No. And no. Okay. All right. All said and done, this place should hold like 150 guys, I think. So, that's pretty good. How are our cooks doing? I decided to be a generous, uh, generous warden and started giving them some more delicious food. They're getting bacon now. Who doesn't like bacon? Yeah, I, I'm, I'm, it's costing me a little bit extra money, but you can see here, medium meal quantity and medium meal variety. So it's costing me a little extra money, but uh, there's only one guy who hasn't been fed. And everyone's everyone's gotten fed. 63% of guys have been fed. Uh, that means that only 63% of guys actually wanted it. See, look at that. No one's hungry anymore. Everyone's so happy. Things are going so well. Here's the thing that I'm most proud of, though, guys. Look at this. Check this out. Check this out. $470,000. Yes. Yes. Our prison is worth so much. We're not finished, obviously. Um, I think in next episode that you guys see will be the foundation for the remaining sections here will be being placed. So we have eleven thousand dollars. We're going to place this next piece of the foundation. All right, get to work, boys. All right, so with this last foundation block f coming uh, coming into uh, into creation here, look at that! Look at that! Yeah, uh? it's not quite how I expected that to go. Uh, damn. Whoops. Just repair that hole. And I think, unfortunately, we need to save up our money for another um, 
power generator and capacitors and these capacitors cost what a thousand dollars each and this costs five thousand dollars all right so we have to save the rest of our money to build more electrical actually how much space do we have on the thing right now two blocks all right that'll be about the last thing we can put the power to though Yeah, we're going to have to save up the cash for the rest of the money, or uh, save up the money for the rest of the uh, power, because we're going to be out of that stuff real soon. Oh, damn, this guy's cell wall is missing. Uh, materials wall. My bad. So, it looks like that'll be the end of that. Uh, okay, what should we do now? Let's see. Let's see if we can't get the kitchen a little bit more established here. See, that's how the cookers were supposed to have placed. Against the frickin' walls. But look at that, they all placed like a half... Like a half meter off the wall. I don't know why they did that. It looks cramped in there now. Oh well, as long as it works, I don't really give a shit. And it works. Oh yeah, prisoner intake. Let's take a look at that for a second, because I've uh, I've changed it up. So yeah, closed is low risk, only normal risk guys. So we have 70 normal risk guys in here now. I don't like your face. Search his cell. I've been picking guys at random, just like this, and just going, search cell. Sim seems to be pretty effective at uh, catching little pieces of contraband here and there. Our paramedics are still on site, if you have, haven't have noticed. I'm using them as security cameras. Uh, we got one guy in the laundry over there. He's keeping everything nice and... Uh, nice and effective. <laughs> I kind of like that we're using them as security cameras. I think that's kind of funny. Our prison seems like it's running really smoothly, though. I'm not having any issues. These guys are not rioting, they're not angry, everyone seems like they're really happy, everything seems like it's going really smoothly. What more could I ask for, I suppose? Anyway, like I said, we're going to finish off this section of the prison block, and the next episode will be the completed prison. Then we'll play, then I'll play for like another two episodes or something like that, and then I'll sell it off, and it's medium prison time. So, I gotta say, I, I wasn't expecting this to be very doable for a series because the last couple of times I've tr played this game it's been such a slow grind that I felt I had to cheat in stuff to be able to make it interesting and I gotta say this has been a lot slower than some of the other episodes that I've been you know Alpha 16 17 was probably a lot more interesting than this one is that's uh, that's just because of the fact that I can't I can't really give you guys everything you want to see in one big dose like I could before when I had hundreds of thousands of dollars uh, you know, it's a little bit slower paced, it's a little bit slower to do it, but this, this is done specifically to prove that the game does function if you play it properly. You can make these things happen. Your dreams can come true. They can, I believe in it. But, um, what are you doing? I don't like you. And you, why are you not sleeping? Search him. Anybody who's awake is getting searched, simple as that. I don't trust you. So you can see the twin showers is uh, definitely a hit. It's working really effectively. I'm pretty sure everyone's getting showered. Hygiene met. Hygiene was more or less met by everybody. Free time will give them a chance to get that done if they haven't gotten it done. 
And uh, let's see. So workshops up and running here. Our behavioral therapy. Let's see how that program's doing. Ooh, a whole one person's finished it and passed it. How wonderful. I'm so happy. Uh, I was having a second thought about that education thing. I've decided, guys, that I'm going to turn a section of this block into forestry and education. So how big does forestry have to be? Five by five. Okay, the classroom has to be a five by five, so let's just measure that out. So there's five by five classroom. 5x8 classroom even. And the rest of this will be forestry, which gives us a space of 11 by 8 Okay. And that gives us the ability to basically end game this prison cell, this prison block. You know, it's a little bit less prisoners than I was going to have originally, but... Um, I think it's going to work out better. These guys are fucking tripping over each other, Jesus. That's still a lot of prison cells. But I just didn't want to I didn't want to uh, neglect the fact that, you know, forestry is a part of the game. We're not we're not doing it, sir. So uh, it's not really cool. Armory, we'll do the research on that guy now. It's two grand out of the way. And like I said, next episode I'm going to have this prison block finished and I'm going to lay the foundation for this one. So you may not see some of that stuff, but it's, that's not really that important. Oh, deployment. We lost two guys on the deployment again. How's things running? Pretty smoothly. Happy to say. Everyone's getting fed. Freaking perfect. It's a little bit more expensive, but uh, everyone's getting fed, so that's the important part. All right, start laying this foundation. Or, sorry, the uh, walls. Get these cells all finished. And we're laughing. Hmm. Just like that. And we'll get this down here. Alright, look at this guy. Look at this freaking thing's coming along perfectly. 
So I'll just leave out this prison cell for right now because it would just uh, it would cut off these guys kind of pretty substantially. So I'll just leave that for right now. Planning phase is done. Should I be generous and give these guys windows as well? I think maybe I'll do that. Just on that one row of prison cells, so whoever was lucky enough to get those prison cells gets a sweet-ass window. Sweet-ass windows. I think we still need to hire another dog handler, but there's more important things to finish, such as these prison cells. We're going to be at uh, prison capacity again soonish. All right, we'll just leave that. Leave the fifteen hundred dollars in place. Let's see how you're doing with your reform. Condition: suppressed, hurt, none. Behavioral therapy is going along. Another class or so, he'll be finished. Expensive to run that, I say. How's our power grid? Oh, peaking. All right, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to put down another uh, generator soon, so I'm gonna have to save up some money. So there'll be a couple of days of saving for that. Like I said in the next episode, though, you guys are gonna see the completed completed prison block. At least all the foundation will be laid. If nothing else, the foundation is gonna be laid. So. And then we just have to what? We just have to finish off the kitchen, uh, the armory, the workshop. And that's it. That's it, baby. We got everything finished. I'm excited. Hope you're excited. This has been this has been neat. I didn't think this would be would be very doable. Like I didn't think it would work out well, but it's coming out coming out real well. It's been very effective. I'm kind of stoked. We're going to have a little forestry section right here. We're going to have uh, our classroom right here for reform purposes. You know? It's going to be good. Anyways, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the next episode of our completed prison.